Hi everybody, it's Matt with a SketchUp skill builder for you. Today I'm going to be talking about how to get SketchUp models and models from the 3D warehouse into uh, Photoshop. So here I have this model in Photoshop and I'm going to show you how to do that. So I'll just get rid of this. You know, the 3D warehouse has millions of models that you can bring into Photoshop. Unfortunately, you can't bring SKP files right in, so the best file type to use is a Collada file. And on most models in the 3D Warehouse, you can click on this download button, and then it'll have the Collada file option. You can just download that and import it right in. Um, I want to bring this coffee table in. Unfortunately, this does not have the Collada download option, but that's not a problem at all, because if we switch over to SketchUp, I've got this uh, model downloaded from the 3D Warehouse already, just right into my SketchUp file. And if I go to File, Export, 3D Model, it'll bring up this Export dialog box. And I'll choose Collada File, hit Export, and then I'll switch back over to Photoshop, uh, make a new file. Here we go, here's our new file. And uh, I'll go to 3D, new 3D layer from file. So here's my uh, coffee table that I exported out of SketchUp. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and hit open here. And it'll bring up this uh, dialog box. I'm just gonna leave these as they are. I can resize the model later if I need to. And it'll automatically bring up the model right in Photoshop there. So if you click on any material in here, this is kind of cool, it'll bring up in this 3D panel the material that you clicked on, and then you can change the material options right in here. There's sliders for, you know, different types of material options. And then when you click on this render button, right here in the bottom of the properties panel, it'll start doing render passes. And depending on how complex your model is, it might take a little bit longer for it to render. Um, and then down here in the bottom left, it'll show you how much time your render has left in a second here. But yeah, so you can see all the options that you could come up with with all the models you can download from the 3D Warehouse and any model you create yourself uh, in SketchUp, being able to bring it into Photoshop and render it in there. That's how you bring SketchUp models and 3D Warehouse models into uh, Photoshop. Try it out for yourself, guys.